you out of love God. First John 5 and 3. If you could come, come, come closer. Please. Five seconds. Hallelujah. Right? Pop it up for this man. Thank you. Right? We've been out here about 15 minutes. We haven't seen anyone yet. Right? All praises. Right? So what we're doing out here is that we're showing people how to love God. Do you know who we are? You ever seen us before? No? Okay. First. Okay. So first John 5 and 3. Okay. Let me show you how to love God. Right? First John 5 and 3. Since the book of first John. How do you love God then? Hold on. How do you love God then? How, to, how do you love God? Oh, keep my commandments. Hallelujah. But what are some of the commandments? Huh? What are some of the commandments? Let me get the Leviticus. Let me show you something. Are you with me? Say that again. Exodus chapter 20. Yeah. It's more than 10 commandments though. You know that, right? No. It's more than Ten Commandments. That's how and, oh, and you live by the Ten yeah, no, so, 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 Commandments. Listen, listen, listen. Go, 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 go down. Okay. Exodus 20. Okay, fine. Exodus, Watch this. Right? Exodus chapter Exodus 20 and verse 8. Don't tell me. That's why God gave it to me. Okay. You don't tell me they got more. Okay. Why, why are you going to tell me that? So let me show you something. You say you... Do you understand what I'm about to tell you? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Do you... Do why you, do you, do you you said that the commandments, the Ten Commandments, huh? that these they are the commandments that God gave you to live by, right? Yeah. So let's see one of the commandments that you're not following right now. Watch this. Exodus chapter is 20, verse 8. Bible? This is the uh, this is, is in the Ten Commandments. Is the Bible? Is it, is it that this is in the Ten Commandments, right? The Ten that you say there's Ten, right? Exodus 20 and 8. Read that. The book of Exodus, chapter 20 and verse 8. Uh-huh. Remember the Sabbath day. Remember what? The Sabbath day. Remember what? The Sabbath day. Remember the Sabbath day. What is the Sabbath day? What's the Sabbath day? What is Sabbath day? Yes. What is this? When is the Sabbath day? Then when is the Sabbath day? What day is the Sabbath? It's Saturday, right? So what are you supposed to do on Sabbath day? You don't supposed to do nothing. Watch this. Keep reading. Keep reading. I'm going to show you something. Remember the Sabbath day uh -huh. to keep it holy. To keep it holy, meaning keep it separate, right? Read on. Six days shalt thou labor. You can work all the other days, but the seventh day, keep reading. And do all thy work. Uh -huh. But the seventh day keep reading. is the Sabbath. Is the, the what? Is the Sabbath. It's the Sabbath. The Saturday is the Sabbath. Read on. Of the most high thy uh, power. Of the most high thy power. Give me uh, um, 10 to 31. Jeremiah. Was that Nehemiah? Nehemiah, Nehemiah 10 to 31. The water. Right? Let me show you something. Because if you're going in here on the Sabbath day, that means you're not following the Ten Commandments. You said you live by the Ten Commandments, yeah. right? Yeah. You say you love God. You got to do the commandments. Yeah, but you know what I'm going to do that? Wait, wait, what are you going to do? <laughs> you do know what I'm going to do? What are you going to do? Buy something. Huh? How do you know? <laughs> what are you going into the store for? To look How around? You know? huh? Are you going to look around? Yes. That's no, it. And you're going to come back out? Oh, no, 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 come on, man. Come on. Stop no, being listen, silly. Listen. Read that. Ne Nehemiah 10 and 31. Listen. The book of Nehemiah. Chapter 10 and verse 31. Are you seven no, we are Jews. We are the real Israelites. God's chosen people and so are you. You're yeah. from Haiti, right? Yeah, if you're Haiti. from Haiti, I'm you would be from the tribe of Levi. Yeah. You're from the tribe of Levi. Yeah. What happened? How did you guys get to Haiti? What? How did you get to Haiti? Get to Haiti? Yes. What do you mean? How did your people, your fathers, your grandfathers, your ancestors, how did they get to Haiti? What do you mean? They're from Haiti. They're from Haiti. What? They, they didn't come from anywhere. They just oh. were played. By, by what? That's all they stole. Slavery. Yeah. yeah. They got there by boat. Yeah. What were you before you got to Haiti? Before I got to Haiti? Before your people got to Haiti. That name, that's that. All they stole. Huh? Okay. That's the other story? No, no, don't leave. Don't leave. Come on, brother. You was just dialoguing. Keep reading. The book of Nehemiah, chapter 10, and verse 31. Mm -hmm. And if the people of the land bring war or any victuals on the Sabbath day. If you bring victuals on the Sabbath day, hey brother, you cannot buy on the Sabbath day. If you say you love God, you just said you love God, you cannot buy on the Sabbath day. There's no such thing, man. And you gotta grow your beard. You gotta repent for your lies, man. Right? They start running when you start bringing out the truth. Oh, that's a whole other story. I don't want to talk about that. That's a whole other story. Keep reading, man. To say that we will not buy Right, keep reading. Eat of them on the Sabbath day. Right, so we can't sell and we cannot buy on the Sabbath day. When the Sabbath day come around, we're 
you're not allowed to be buying anything, man. You're supposed to be buying things the day before the Sabbath starts. Because what? The Sabbath day belongs to God. See, a lot of people don't understand why we're getting shot down. Did you see the brother that got shot down in Georgia and cold blood? Where's his justice? Where's his mercy? Everybody continue living their life like they like like his life don't matter, man. Because what? When you look at the black man, everybody think the black man's life don't matter. They think that the Hispanic man's life don't matter. We've been getting shot down since we stepped foot in this country, man. And who's gonna help us? Right? Who's gonna help us? Who are you? Jump at the Deuteronomy 28:15. Right? Because a lot of people don't understand. Shalom, sister, how you doing? Sister, Publix. Publix. Right? See, a lot of people don't, they don't want to give us time, but guess what? Nobody's fighting for your rights like we are, man. Because everybody gets upset when they look at the videos of, of the brother getting shot down in cold blood by those two white men, but you don't have time to understand why. I'm just going to keep doing my thing. As long as I'm living, that's all that matters. Right? Exactly. You're probably convicted in his spirit. So Deuteronomy 28, 15. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, and verse 15. I'm happy you didn't buy anything, brother. Huh? I tried to judge? Are we allowed to judge? Can we judge you? Are we allowed to judge you? Give me Proverbs 31 and 9. Are we allowed to judge? Bring it out. See, a lot of people, they just like to say things and run because you don't know God, man. You do not know God. To love God is keep the commandments. Grow your beard and keep the Sabbath day. Don't buy anything on the Sabbath day. Wear your fringes. No eating grio. Read what you got. The book of Proverbs chapter 31 and verse 9. Uh-huh. Open thy mouth. Do what? Open thy mouth. Open my, open thy mouth, read off. Judge righteously. Do what? Judge righteously. We got to judge righteously. I thought we couldn't judge. See, that's the problem. Because nobody's judging you, you feel like you can do whatever you want to do. You feel like you can self-judge. You feel like you can go say whatever you want to say to anybody. You know what I mean? You feel like you don't have to keep the laws. Right? Because I don't want to be judged. Come on, man. Read that again. The book of Proverbs, chapter 31, and verse 9. Right? Open thy mouth. Don't judge me. Keep reading. Judge righteously. Judge righteously. We are the judges of the earth, man. You're looking at the service of the Lord thy power, man. Right? You have to come back and serve the Lord in truth and in sincerity, man. Right? Everybody, why, why is coronavirus going on? What's going on right now? Why are so many uh, 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 black men and black women dying? Give me um, an apocryphal, um, the prayer of Azariah, chapter 1. Right? Why are so many of us dying? Do you, know, do you know why? Give me five seconds, please. Please, five seconds. Do you love God? You want to see how to love God? How do you show God love? Huh? I can't hear you, sister. How do you show God love? You want to find out? Stay right there. You want to find out? First John 5 and 3. Hold on. Watch this. Give me one second. First John chapter 5 and verse 3. All right? Give me one second, sister. Let's be, to, to love God, we have to actually do something. You go to church? All right. Let me sh I'm going to ask you a question after I read this scripture. First John 5 and 3. Read on. The book of First John chapter 5 and verse 3. Uh-huh. For this is the love of God. For this is how we love God, right? Read on. That we keep his commandments. That we keep his commandments. Read on. And his commandments are not grievous. And his commandments are not grievous. Have they taught you that in the church? So what commandments do you keep? Because today is the Sabbath day. We're not allowed to buy on the Sabbath day. Did you know that, brother? Did you know that? Why did that black man get killed in Georgia? Do you know? Do you feel bad for him? Look, see, our people, our people are asleep, man. Our people, the black man is the only man you can kill continuously and they get away with it. We are the only people on this earth that you can continue to kill and they get away with it. Where's the rage, man? Where's the anger? What, what man and what black woman is going to stand up for the black man getting killed all day? See, I don't want to talk about the elephant in the room, man. 
You just go about your business, buying your little goods and whatnot. When this man just lost his life, man. What you want? Prayer about the right. Huh. Right? A lot of people say they feel sorry for what happened to that brother. You feel sorry. You, you've seen the video. You've seen him try to fight back. Where was you, man? Where were you at? I'm just going to continue living my life because that got nothing to do with me. As long as my bills getting paid, that's all I care about. Right? What's going on, man? How you doing? Right? Do you feel sorry for what happened to that black man in Georgia? Right? I know you don't care, but that's why you're going into slavery. Right? Right? Because a lot of times people don't understand what's going on in the earth. A lot of times they don't understand why they're taking the bus. A lot of times they don't understand why they're riding bicycles. Listen, man, and it's not to judge you or get on you or degrade you for what you got going on in your life. I'm just trying to show you why we've been, we've been placed in these situations, right? Why we've been placed in situations such as these, right? What's going on, sister? How you doing? Did you see that video of that black man dying in Georgia? They shot him down with the shotgun. You didn't see that? Come, give me five seconds. Hold on. Do you love the black man or do you love the white man? Which one? You love the black man or the white man? Which one? Yeah, I bet you love both. Right? 